Hey folks, Crazy Climber 80 here, Coach Shiley over there, and we are uh, in southeast Portland, uh, near, we were right in front of it, but uh, Snappy's Sandwiches, and it is a sandwich shop with uh, some really cool, uh, authentic... Uh, They're not trying to fool you, a Snappy Sandwiches is a sandwich shop. It, it, yeah. Uh, but yeah. Uh, don't, don't be confused, because in the same little fucking thing, there's like a... Uh, Japanese restaurant or some shit, so there's a giant ass line for that, and then you can walk right. In. Yeah, <laughs> kind I, of a I, weird traffic I, jam. I sat there going, "What's what's going on?" Because there's like a really hopping uh, ramen place right next to it. Um, but that's to the left, and then it was a Japanese place or, to the right. Or yeah, yeah, yeah or something. Yeah. Fuck, I don't so, know. So, but anyway, busy and busy, and then not busy. But that's okay. That's uh, benefited us. Yeah. So uh, we ended up getting three sandwiches because there's so much that looked good. We we initially got four, but one of them they didn't have. No fried chicken. Disappointing. And Goober's most certainly buttermilk, no fried chicken. Buttermilk fried chicken. But uh, owner or fucking staff, whoever the shit the guy was, pretty cool guy. Even though yeah. the Trailblazers are trash, uh, and he was talking mostly Trailblazers with with Goober over here. But uh, the uh, super friendly dude. Yeah, and there's uh, big points for that these days. Interesting, uh, interesting setup. The the ceiling was basically just a bunch of oh, milk, yeah. milk crates, uh, multicolored <laughs> milk crates all over the fucking place, and then, and then yeah, a, whole, a whole bunch of VHS whole tapes shelf of VHS running tapes. along the whole fucking ceiling there because uh, apparently they uh, used to just have a TV VCR combo playing all that shit. <laughs> so they throw new movies in, and it's broken. And he get he said that they're like two hundred fucking dollars to to find a replacement. Yeah, weird and weird old stuff weird is fucking expensive. Portland. You got a lady walking down the street in a fucking shark outfit. And uh, bear ears or Whatever something. the fuck is going yeah, on. People, what are, a, people are stupid. Yeah, I this place is awful. Um, okay, so let's get to some... I want to go that okay. first. This so, this is our four-pointer, and this has uh, a whole bunch of uh, the Italian, Italian meats. Classic Italian sandwich. I think it Sopracetta comes with mustard, but they did the mustard for us. Yeah, yeah, they. Yeah, we didn't want mustard because it's garbage. Yeah, because mustard's icky and disgusting. And this is probably the uh, roast beef. Feels like it. It's hot. No, that's the. Or, no? It's, it looks like it's. Oh, it's spicy the the sausage. it's the uh, sausage. Yeah, the spicy uh, sausage with uh, provolone and. Uh, and this, I'm guessing, is the beef sauce. and cheddar. Well, beef and cheddar action. Uh, no horseradish. Okay. Yeah, didn't didn't want horseradish, didn't want mustard on anything. Uh, that does not come with oju. You can order it for a, a dollar. But apparently they dunk the fucking. But they meat dunk. In it. They dunk and the meat in it. Hopefully it doesn't need right, it. Tear up our first one. So let's let's if start it's with a four pointer. Half, let's see. Yeah, fuck yeah, I love Italian sandwiches. Uh, where's the? Okay, yeah, I gotta be able to stick it off. Get in. And they also have uh, curly fries and a whole bunch of interesting uh, uh, ice cream treats in the freezers. Oops, I didn't cut them off. And I guess it's cut in half. So. Hand me half that motherfucker. Here right. is a, a little better. sub roll. Okay, so it looks like, I can't tell if that's just smashed up fucking... Tomato, or if they got some kind of a uh, pepper type thing going on. Yeah, I saw that. I'm in. I love it. So, so it looks like we've got yeah, it looks like, or looks like maybe uh, sun dried tomatoes. Yeah, we're about to find out. Well, cheers. I fucking love these kind of sandwiches. Yeah. Mm. Mm, definitely not hurting for flavor. Can you hand me the bag so I have some, something to eat over because it's jumping all over the place? Yeah. Got ripped to shreds, but... Yeah, it's a good sandwich. Mmm. Mm. So you got lettuce, um, pepperoncinis, is that what it is? Red onions. Yeah, so they're either pepperoncinis or banana peppers or one too. Yeah. That's that's tasty. Yeah, that's pretty good. Kind of your standard Hot. Italian. Um, really, to me, it's only when they're like 
a lot of vinegar on it. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's supposed to be. I think is a problem, um, yeah. With an Italian, if you get the super high quality meats, this is the only way that it really elevates to me. But even a regular one is fucking good. Uh-huh. Really, anybody that... Any food snob that tries to tell you that Portland doesn't have any any good of this or any good of that type of food they're full of it you might Portland's have got to, pretty good food yeah you you might have to go on a bit of a jaunt to get to some of them but there there's there's good stuff for every uh every type of food mm. as far as Italian sandwiches go bunk makes a really good one really oh, yeah. good one I think for the sake of saving space on this, we can just smash our sandwiches out real quick. What now? I said, yeah, finish our sandwiches real quick mm. instead of Normally we take a couple bites, but and then talk to death about like every ingredient. Under the next one. Mm-hmm. And not crazy expensive. These are what twelve-ish bucks. Twelve, thirteen, yeah. So I mean, average for a sandwich. All right, what's up next? I'll go with the uh, spicy uh, sausage. Mm hmm. There we go. Yeah, that's it's a little heavier on the vinegar than the most sandwiches I've had, but I, I'm not complaining. Yeah, it's good. Yeah. Okay, there you go. All right, well, let me, nice little let me, fucking Let me pull show there. close the, the pulling of the cheese. Ooh. There you go. Can one of them over. Perfect. So. Okay, we'll so. We'll see how, just how spicy. Just one big chunk of... Uh, yeah, it's, it's God, bread. It almost, it, yeah, it's, it's deep, deep fried, fried breaded. Yeah, it's deep fried sausage. See, how fucking bizarre. I, yeah, I, it said that in the uh, description. Oh, so really? It's like, I, oh, this I, could be interesting. A little bit typical in terms of a sauce well, flavor. There's a little, there's a little kick to it. I mean, it's not hot, but that's it might take me a second. Yeah, that's there. Maybe, yeah, maybe a little tea bit. I had to get past the vinegar from the last sandwich. Yeah, the, uh... I wish that there was a way there for it to be a little crispier, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. But obviously you throw the red sauce on it and immediately it's soggy. Mm-hmm. You're talking crispy with the uh, coating of the sausage. Totally. Like mm -hmm. maybe they need to have a hotter oil or something. I don't know. It still tastes good. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm used to it being a uh, regular sausage, not a sausage patty that's fried up. But it's, it's good. Mm -hmm. Or maybe if they, uh, instead of deep frying the sausage deep fried the uh the cheese you know what I mean? mm -hmm. but there's still a little crunchy to the uh coating a little bit yeah i mean it's it's not a bad sandwich no I'm starting to like this a little bit more as i really get into it i'm getting a little bit more a little bit more crispiness of the uh 
coating yeah. at the end. That's, yeah, especially on the on the sides. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah, I'm starting to feel a little bit more of the heat from the the spice, just a little bit. I would imagine that it's just like a uh, standard hot Italian sausage. Instead of it being a spicy sauce, you know what I mean? Mm hmm But it's good they got the right bread, you know? Oh, yeah. Got to have some kind of substance there, otherwise it just, it just completely goes soggy. So it's not, per se, hoagie. Or what is it? Yeah, I don't know. I'd, I'd say it's a hoagie roll, though. Yeah, Maybe. All right. Yep. It's a little crustier than if it were like a uh, Philly roll, you know? Yeah. Which is good. Yeah, for sure. We need to do our uh, uh, police squad closing. <laughs> okay. Yeah, okay. Um, you know what I mean, right? <laughs> okay. So now we're going into our... Uh, our beef and cheddar it's double wrapped Which tells me maybe it is juicy all schmagged out oh they didn't chop that one so you just kind of oh. start fucking eating on oh. it oops didn't give me a, a I can, oh, I, oh you can, I can break I can break Ooh. those big big fat onion ah oh, motherfucker you fucking <laughs> retard god damn it uh, and it's got, uh, but big uh, onions. Yeah, onions, and then there's like the little uh, French fried onions too. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh yep, yep. And there's the beef there. Do this all back. It is moist. Mm, I can taste a little. Now it comes with the horseradish sauce. Typically, we opted without. Because we're not stupid. We don't like disgusting things. Um, but yeah, this is this juicy. I can taste a little a little bit of the oju in it. Mm-hmm. Mm. Yeah, that's good too. Mm-hmm. I bet you that that uh, horseradish cuts down the richness a little bit. Not that it's a bad sandwich, but like, that's probably it's designed to it, you know what I mean? Yeah, maybe. But it's, but it's not good, worth yeah. It. <laughs> I, I would say that probably get the Aju cup to dunk it in. That probably makes a big difference, I would guess. Just, yeah, just generally uh -huh. roast beef sandwich. You really need to have juice with it. You can never have enough. Mm. Yeah, it is well worth coming out here just once because you have to look at the freaking weird. Yeah, right. You have to look at ugly Portland. people. Yeah. I can never understand how people can like see homeless people and seriously mentally off people and it's go, enduring. "Oh, this this is beautiful. So so wonderful to have all walks of life." Hmm. Whatever. Yeah, I think it's a uh, successful little trip here. Mm -hmm. There are a shit ton of onions on this. There are. <laughs> but they're grilled up. Yeah. There's a little sweetness to the onions because I caramelized them. Yeah, they're grilled and they're soggy. so they. Yeah, it's, that's all there. The bite of them is, is not nearly strong. <laughs> mm -mm. Well, clearly they're yellow onions or white onions. Yeah. They're not like not, kicking not the in the ones. face. Yeah, it was darn tasty. Yeah, pretty good. Mm hmm. You're not going to completely polish yours off? I have just bread left. I'm down to a few, few little bites. Knock that out. But again, this is uh, Snappies. Snappies at Southeast Ankeny and Sixth. And if you want to park, 
um, there's like a there's like a lot mm, that you lot there that, that yeah that's a O'Reilly's lot. So the good news is Ankeny itself isn't a super busy street, so there is uh, some available parking. Each of the blocks that we drove past, there were there were available parking. Mm -hmm. Which, hey, bonus today because it's a uh, Veterans Day. Veterans Day, so it didn't have to pay. That's right. Which, that's pretty fucking rad. Yeah, I was look, I was looking around and oh shit, this is weird. Looking for some sort of meter or something, but yeah, no, no. Nope. Yeah, yeah. Well, I went to the meter and they're like, oh hey, stupid, it's a holiday. You don't have to pay. Fucking rad. <laughs> But, um, yeah, I'm happy with it. Mm -hmm. Good little fucking sandwich shop. Like, if, if I, well, I would never live in this troll fucking area, but if I worked in this area, like if I worked at the Subaru store that's here right fucking next to it, yeah, I'd walk over to that motherfucker for a sandwich every day. Yeah. So, uh, uh, yeah, uh, it, I hate this, hate this part of town because... Because it fucking sucks. Because it sucks. There's disgusting people and there's there's crime. Oh yeah, yeah. There's everything <laughs> everything that makes Portland fucking suck here. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, so when will people learn that crime doesn't pay? Well, but, crime does pay if you're good at it. But if they if they did learn, then we'd be out of a job. Yeah, right. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> okay.